Hello everyone, this is Issa and welcome back to Moe Tree. So last time we had to deal with a maid who drugged us. No matter how dodgy that sounds, nothing special actually happened apart from the fact we got stuck on the ground for about 5 turns and the battle just ensured as usual, but god that's how games work. So, uh, between the t uh, last time and this time, I've only done a free battle one more time. I'm sitting, I think, pretty, pretty, whoops, pretty much on the upper limit of, um, the free map, which is at 20. Still not too sure how the uh, upper limit works from when you stop getting anything from them, but I have got one extra person, a fire person, Amy, a very normal name. Uh, I'm pretty sure everything comes from some kind of folklore, so I have no idea where this person's from. But uh, we're gonna go into the next story map, which apparently has a maid at the front door and a knight at the back. So this is probably gonna be a hilarious sandwich situation, and we don't really know what's gonna happen, but here we go. Oh funny, they're already both here. I finally found you, now kindly give yourself up into custody. You're really persistent. She is really persistent. This is about a courtesy. Have you any intention of surrender? Um, if I do, wonder what will happen to me. Dungeon or maid, your choice. <laughs> uh huh. What do you mean by maid? Maid means maid. That's probably the most scary threat between dungeon and maid. Hey, we're not talking. For the sake of the princess, we must defeat her and take her into custody at once. Alicia, you become awfully aggressive lately. It's a sign. My soul burns with passion for the mission and feeds me a strength. Oh, you really love your job too much. Passion for the princess, in your case. You can say that as well. Quietly now. Eh? We can't let you escape while we have the upper hand. Now let us fight fair and square. This time I'll have your head. That sounds really threatening. And what will you do with that? We'll take her on together. You will wait, fellas. In accordance with the code of Chibri, oh, I will. Absolutely not. You already lost once, anyway. But my honor is a knight. It's for the princess. The maid is pretty much at the top of the hierarchy. No matter where you go, the maid's always at the top of the hierarchy. Fellas, to arms. We must strike her together with our combined troops. Doesn't that sound kind of glorious? What happened to your code of Chibri? Is this Chibri or is it Chivalry? I think I've heard us, uh, pronounce both ways. Anyways, but, but, if it's between the princess or Shari, I'll choose the princess every time. And that's that. Just give up now that you've awoken the dragon. Okay, so we've got the knight who walks around like a rook from, um, chess. And we have now the maid, who's actually the first time we're dealing with her. Why is a maid a necromancer? That sounds really scary. But, uh, anyway, she uses sacrifice summons, which I have no idea what how that works. Mine is the, um, magic shrekle summons, so. Uh, I guess for now, we should probably build a wall up against, um, this person. So, let's do that. Because when it comes down to it, I can always, um, basically build a giant wall. Okay, she's using magic stones. Okay, so you basically have something, you sacrifice it to summon another thing. That seems a little interesting. Alright, so she's actually summoning stuff this time. Which means I need to bring stuff out a bit quicker. Um, how about you? You are very good at fighting though, that's a bit of a problem. Um, I guess you have to do... And we shall, while we're here, take a step forward. She can't really reach me, so, um... Just pop that down. Just burn her down slowly, because that's how we do it. Alright, one turn and three turns, so let's bring people in. We'll start bringing people in. And I'm also going to, uh, blind you. Have fun with that. Okay. So I believe you are bringing light things. You're bringing dark things. Okay. No, you're bringing ice things. Oh, that didn't hurt too much, so we should be fine here. She is not moving. Uh-huh. Okay. 
Okay, so she sacrificed the skeleton to summon something. No. Wait, did she just sacrifice a big one? Yeah, she just sacrificed a big one. Okay. Also, I just noticed a level 17 and I'm sitting at uh, 19 to 22. Uh, <laughs> uh, let's see. I don't really have something that doesn't cost too much. Oh, how about I just get rid of one of you first? Uh, I'm just gonna start blasting the crap out of you and hopefully get rid of you quickly. And I'm just gonna uh, come over here this way, goodbye, I'm getting out of here. And I'll come, come over here. Alright, you're nearly burnt all the way down from the poison, which helps. It's also really easy to get out of the way from her, so it always helps. Alright, you can fly. Yeah, she sacrificed a big thing instead of the skeleton that she just randomly summoning and just kind of killed herself. Um, I do have AoE here. I should be able to blow you up with a couple more hits. How much does this do? I can actually remember. I need to get closer. Uh, that's a problem. Oh yeah, Argos is coming in next turn, we'll be fine. Oh great, they have one too. Very good. Goodbye. Poison! Alright, we need to bring up a light person. They're raising another skeleton. One of the skeletons that basically reached me. And then... Okay! Oh, uh, the difference is that I'm stronger than you. Which always helps. Alright, so... Uh, we can form a new line, or we can just start summoning again, summon you from here. Then I'm just gonna do that. What? Okay. Uh, Prince, this has extra range, so then do that! And then we'll just move forward over to here, and we'll do that. Smack! Alright. So the question is, is this maid gonna walk towards me? She threw a rock at me. She's literally just standing there. Okay, I'm gonna have a on her. Ow! Alright, so you're gonna come over here and we're gonna do this. Oh, right, it's in the line. Okay. Hold up, how do I just go? Nice. Alright, that's perfectly good. And we'll come over here. And we'll do. I'm a far in my laser. Take that. Alright, you come over here. And we'll smack you in the face. Take that. Uh, what are we gonna do? How much does this cost? Uh, yeah. I know for a fact I got actually some little bit of trouble um, firing forts since I have one myself. Yeah. Okay, that could be a problem. Uh, let's see. That doesn't have much range. Okay, um. Beam! Uh, then we come over here. 
Do that. We'll actually blast you. These skeletons are luckily very weak. Um, actually, they will keep it like this. Come into here and heal. Then we'll just blast you in the face to get rid of you. Take that. Okay. Now then, we advance. Is she actually gonna come towards me? Well, it's just gonna repeat itself for a while. Um, how much speed do I actually have? I think I'm supposed to return them to the Akira Kami SP. I think that's how it works. Alright, so... Mark! Goodbye. Oh, that's an interesting battle. Uh, let's just stop I'm quite literally slowly encroaching in on her territory here. Um... Alright, now we're kinda out of uh, everything, so you know what? Let's just do nothing. Okay, that was random. Uh, we will just drop a poison in your face here. Yeah. Uh, you are basically an AoE attacker, so... You don't have much range. That might be a problem. Uh, this wasn't ranged yet. And I can also self-destruct if I really felt like it. <laughs> Which could be fun as well. Whoop, that was wrong. My bad. Ah, uh, doesn't matter. I think we're pretty much fine at this point. That. Nope. Uh, wait, wh which one's my AoE one? The water one. Alright, goodbye. You just got the crap smacked out of you. And we have arrived. Let's smack you out of that corner. Alright, the skeletons aren't actually gonna do anything, so instead we're gonna just smack you in the face again because that's how this works. Smack. And goodbye. Alright, that was a lot easier than I expected. <laughs> and the skeleton's still tanked there. Alright. Now, I'll dispel the curses on both of you. Why do they both have curses? Curses? Help us, Nishri Rhyme. <laughs> Something happened! <laughs> Nothing happened. Eh? Oh. Just her? Then why did you attack me? Because this is a castle and you are you are an intruder. Doesn't that make a lot of logical sense? Oh, I'm sorry. But it's not what it looks like. I have business here, or rather, I have business with the mirror that's here. Um, I have this. It's a letter of introduction from the chief of my village. If you had such a thing, then why didn't you show it at the gate in the first place? I ran to that person, Alicia, and then I see. I can I can sympathize with that. You probably could. At any rate, I never imagined we would be defeated together. Eh, <laughs> that wasn't a compliment. Ah. Uh, now that I know who you are, can you tell me more about these curses? Oh yeah, duh. Well that was a really quick explanation. I see. So that's what's been causing all this trouble lately. With you as well. It is what it is. It sounds like there's no way to prevent it. So it seems. Dinirize, what business do you have here? Oh, I just thought maybe you let me use the fast side mirror that's in the castle. Understood. But if you would come with me. 
Without even asking the princess, first we need to. Alicia, be quiet. Let's go. Wait, wait, wait. I'm telling you to wait. Huh? Is it really okay? Ah, wait up. Well, that is why you let the maid take care of things, because they're at the top of the hierarchy. Okay, so that was probably the most anticlimactic uh, pincer attack I've seen in a while. Hey, look, we got a new free map. Oh, great, it's Masters. So we can't get anything um new out of these maps, which kind of sucks. We're in the castle as well. Uh, huh. I would like to um change up thing my team a little bit, so maybe I'll probably do the um, previous free map maybe a couple more times. I still don't know how the uh, upper limit thing works that prevents you from getting stuff. I don't know if it's your average level or your higher levels or something or other, but there are still a couple of gaps I'd like to fill in my team where some people just aren't very good at fighting, some people obviously need to support and I'm not very good at using them apart from this person who's really good at supporting. Uh, but anyways, I suppose we are going to see the mirror. Nope, we're going to run to the princess. Well, that's going to be fun. So, anyways, that'll be it for this episode of Moe Curry. If you want to follow along with the rest of the series, remember to subscribe. Thanks for watching, and until next time.